Dick by Sam Trout, who's there? Barnardo, number Dick 365 transmission 143 through 137. So I'm going to talk things about in this room. The, we, we, we have the universe, and it, and it, it, it claims claim to be a belief, belief. Someone, someone, something, something happened, 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 and it's so They don't, some, yeah. It, it's funny how musical things are when they are hollow. The NSA specifically targets the communications of everyone. It ingests them exactly. by default. The it collects them in its system, and it filters them, and it analyzes them, and it measures them, and it stores them for periods of time, simply because that's the easiest, most efficient, and most valuable way to achieve these ends. So while they may uh, be intending to uh, target someone associated with a foreign government or someone that they suspect of terrorism, they're collecting your communications to do so. Uh, any analyst at any time can target anyone, uh, any selector, anywhere. Where those uh, communications will be picked up depends on the range of the sensor networks and the authorities that that analyst is uh, empowered with. Not all analysts have the ability to target everything, but I, sitting at my desk, uh, certainly had the authorities to, to wiretap anyone from you or your accountant out. to a federal judge to even the president if I had a personal email. I did eat some of the interior that was extended to me. It was crazy. It was crazy. What is not, is not known, known and will never, and will never be, known be known is the man, is the man whose, body, whose nourished body nourished us. us. It, was it was only one, one but, his but his name will never be spoken. I, I think that the public is owed an explanation of the motivations behind the people who make these disclosures that are outside of the democratic model. When you are subverting the power of government, that, that's a fundamentally dangerous thing to democracy. And if you do that in secret consistently, you know, as the government does uh, when it wants to benefit from a secret action that it took, uh, it'll kind of give its, its officials a mandate to go, hey, you know, tell the press about this thing and that thing so the public is on our side. But they rarely, if ever, do that when an abuse occurs. That falls to uh, individual citizens. The great profile, the sudden jolt made of sand. We're different from anybody else. Uh, I don't have special skills. Uh, I, I'm just another guy who sits there day to day in the office, watches what happening, what's happening, and goes, this is something that's not our place to decide. The public needs to decide whether these programs and policies are right or wrong. Happy tasks for the sorry caged animal, dull edges biting into things. And I'm willing to go on the record to defend the authenticity of them and say, I didn't change these. I didn't modify the story. This is the truth. This is what's happening. You should decide whether we need to be doing this. The con becomes airborne when the flow of deceit attains a complexity sufficient to reduce common sense appearance to illusion. The knot tightening at the back of our heads. I yo was. At this moment, the operation floats free from reality. Moreover, in principle, there is no difference between a white echo check and a global fix. The larger and more pervasive the deceit, the more mind share it must be witched. Yeah, I, I could be, you know, rendered by the CIA. I, I could have uh, people come after me or any of their, their third-party partners. Uh, you know, they, they work closely with a number of other nations. Uh, or, you know, they could pay off the triads or, you know, any, any of their agents or assets. Uh, we've, we've got a CIA station just up the road in the, the, the consulate here in Hong Kong. Uh, and I'm sure they're going to be uh, very busy for the next week. Um, and that's, that's a, a fear of... On the one hand, I practice every precaution, and on the other, there are times when I feel too calm, perhaps, and begin to feel small satisfactions. Or I look at those uniformed toys and feel sorry for them, she writes. At the same time, I want to laugh in their faces, say to them, how stupid you are, where is your power? But circulating among those people, investing in my new personality, and convincing them that I'm one of them, my hidden self observes all. Transmission.